We interrupt our programming at this time to bring you updates on the developing story of a helicopter crash. Helicopter crashes, two dead and one rescued. The National Emergency Management Agency, NEMA, has confirmed this afternoon that two persons died in a helicopter that crashed at Okpebi in Ikeja, Lagos. The acting coordinator of the Lagos Territorial Office of NEMA, Ibrahim Farintoye, confirmed the development. The crash occurred at number 16 Salvation Road in Okwebi, north of Lagos. One person was rescued alive and two persons died, including the pilot. The helicopter, a Bell 206 with registration number BNBQW, which belongs to Quorum Aviation, came in from Port Harcourt, the River State capital, with two crew members and a passenger. The black box has been recovered. We now go over to our Plus TV Africa correspondent live on the scene, Mary Chinda, to give us an update. Hello, Mary. Mary, what do you see happening around you at the scene of this crash? Okay, good afternoon. Just in case you can hear me, um, this is um, number 16 of oh, baby, um, oh, uh, at um, number 16 Salvation Street right here at um, oh, baby, where at about 12.17 p.m. sadly um, today, um, a helicopter had actually crashed, um, killing two persons, um, the, um, the um, DG of last night has just confirmed to us that two persons have actually um, been deposited, two bodies have actually been deposited at the hospital, and uh, one person was actually, um, 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 ha is actually still alive. But the challenge, however, is not just with what has happened, it's with the, the people around here, it's with the fear that they're having to live with. I can see people, you know, all over the place, people um, up who are still um, taking a look at what is going on and they're wondering how the government actually intends to deal with the situation. All right. Mary Chinda, the Plus TV Africa correspondent, reporting live on the scene of the helicopter crash right here in Okpebi, Lagos. We'll bring you more updates as the situation unfolds. Thanks for watching.